Did you know that 94% of employees would stay longer in their role if their employer would offer them just one thing and it's not more money, it's not a pay rise, it's something else. If you want to find out what that is, just keep watching and I will get to it shortly. All civil contractors are feeling the pain right now, probably more than ever before. The order books are full along with a massive skill shortage. As of August 2022, there are currently 3,970 civil project engineering roles advertised on seek.com.au Australia-wide. This gets to show how desperate the current situation is right now. The question arises of what can contractors do to mitigate against severe staff shortage in the current environment. First of all, retaining existing staff should be the number one priority as a low effort and low cost option. In my personal view, creating motivated and satisfied staff that always goes the extra mile is all depending on the environment that a business provides. The working environment becomes the number one criteria in particularly for younger people these days. The millennial generation would choose a good working environment over a better paying job. Of course, pay levels should always match or even better slightly exceed industry standards, but enjoying to come to work becomes more important than any financial gain. This is an area particularly challenging for growing contractors who are transitioning from a smaller business into a larger, maybe even national operation. They often struggle to keep their original vision or just cause alive and their people inspired. This can quickly result in projects and business units operating in silos as the company grows. Here's my hit list of what it takes to create a great working environment where people love to come to work to. First, have a clear vision or purpose that stipulates why the business exists in the first place. This should be an infinite target and aim that has nothing to do with profits. Slogans such as being the best or the largest are results, not visions or just causes. If you're in charge of a construction business, I highly recommend reading the book Start With Why by Simon Sinek, available in our online shop. There are also some great examples within the tier one contractor world. Send me a message if you'd like me to tell you who these contractors are. Second, have your branding efforts reflect your just cause, your vision, so that staff and customers can visually recognize at all times what your business is about. In particular, younger employees are attracted to great brands. It says something about themselves and it also gives them a feel of belonging. Third, leaders need to be always visible and this does not always need to be in person. Good contractors have directors or higher level managers issuing things like weekly email updates, newsletters, internet articles, social media posts, and the list goes on. Staff needs to know who their leaders are and what they stand for. This will allow every staff member to feel connected to the senior leadership team, even if they may never have met yet in person due to the size of the business. Fourth, Provide best practice resources, including sufficient project staff, IT systems and processes. Ensure that your company systems are fit for purpose and are continuously improving and are more than just part of your tender submissions. Fifth, collaboration across projects and business units. Ensure that your project leaders have open communication channels to other projects and that they feel comfortable to ask each other for advice. There are many ways to collaborate at this level, for example via regular project video conferences sharing things such as the top three issues or the top three innovations from every project. Another great way is to have project managers spend one day on each other's projects from time to time. 
Last but absolutely not least, did you know that 94% of employees would stay longer in their role if their employer would provide them with appropriate professional development opportunities? Millennials say learning is the number one thing that makes them happy at work and the number one reason they would leave their job is because they did not have the opportunity to learn and grow. Investing in your staff's professional development provides a business with extraordinary returns. Not only is staff retention boosted to record levels, but so is the quality of work, efficiencies and subsequent customer satisfaction and profits. An employer who really cares about professional development of their people also tremendously encourages an innovative team spirit where excellence and continuous improvement are at the forefront of everything they do. If you would like to find out how we can help your business, feel free to contact me at any time. Thanks for watching and I hope to talk to you soon.